Sunshine Tilling Hast. Morning, Sunshine. How are you? You get several people commenting on your name? Oh, people sing to me and everything. It's a good time. Oh, yeah. All right, you have <laughs> one, two, three. You have four parking tickets. They're all on Richmond Street in the same I, area. I would love to explain. I can't wait. I'm on the edge of my seat. Oh, sir. <laughs> okay, so as you know that when you pay on the, the meter on the phone, the app, you have four hours you have to park there. And then you have to wait 15 minutes, and then you can, put, you can you know, go in the app and do the other four. Because I work right there yeah. on Richmond. And the parking meter lady hides and she waits. She oh. knows she can count 9, 10, 11, 12, 1, you know, and she'll wait. And she's like, this is the 15 minutes, I'm ready. And she comes out and she tags everybody. And then I'm like, well, you know, I can't go out there and wait for you, you know, because I'm working. Hmm. And now they put a boot on my car. Oh. And I know that, you know, we can't do anything about that. Oh. But <laughs> I was just wondering <laughs> about the other three. <clears throat> Well, I think the weather's getting a little stormy today. <laughs> I see the clouds coming over. <laughs> Tell me about the, the uh, parking enforcement officer, Heidi. What do you mean she hides? I, I, she waits, and then she pops out and tags everybody. Because she, you know, she knows it's four hours, and she knows everybody who works over there parks over there. Yeah. So she, she <clears throat> waits it out. And I try to wait it out too. What, like in the nicer weather, I wait out there for the 15 minutes for her to come. Just to be like, hang on, wait a second, just give me 10 more minutes, you know? Because if I could, if I could pay the whole eight hours, I would do that. <laughs> but because that 15 minute block. All right, yeah. your motor vehicle has been booted. There's a mandatory boot fee. The city has already paid $100 on your behalf, Sunshine, oh. to a private company to place a boot on your car. Mm -hmm which means that your car cannot be operated unless you break your car and the boot and the axle and everything else. So you haven't done that? No, ha not, not yet. Not no. yet? No. Okay. <laughs> okay, Sunshine, it's going to cost you a $100 boot fee mm -hmm. to get the boot release. It's going to cost you $50 for the tickets. So it's going to cost you a total of $150. Thank you. Now, what I want you to do is you know when the, when the parking enforcement officer right, is hiding. Yes. So I want you to get your camera. Yeah. Your phone and take pictures. Okay. Of her coming out and tagging the car. All right. And then you come back here and you show me, and then we'll have parking enforcement officer come here, and we'll have a uh, we'll have a meeting. How's that? How's that sound? Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like we're going to shed some light on that situation. <laughs> With sunshine, some, we're going <laughs> to shed some light, Judge. Ah, right, that went over. Right. Come on over. <laughs> Thank That's you. Loud. Good morning. <clears throat> Has this car been towed? Um, no. Well, it was booted almost a month ago. Yeah, that was another boot. Because I parked it outside my house and it got a boot the, the day I bought it. And then recently I was going to um, register it and I went to City Hall to pay um, a tax block that I had. And while I was there, I came out and I had a boot. Well, you, had a, you have a boot because you have 24 unpaid parking tickets. Yeah, those are actually my brother's because those are his plates on the car. Do you know what she's saying? Yes. She went to City Hall to pay off a tax block. While she was there, they rebooted the vehicle. The tickets you're on are her brother's. She bought the vehicle from the brother. She's using the plate. So as long as she's going to use that car with the plate, she's going to continue getting booted. Judge McCann had allowed the vehicle to uh, get the boot off it with the $100 boot fee and leave the tickets in her brother's name. What do you suggest? Well, somebody's going to have to answer for these tickets someday, so. Where's your brother this morning? He's actually at work. Yeah, he works. Yeah, I told him do you to live pay with, off the ticket. Do you live with your brother? No. And you've had a conversation with him but we're paying for these tickets? Yeah. But he's just, he said he's not in the right, he said he's not in the right position to pay them right now. Oh, so he, you're his younger sister, are you? Yeah. And he's leaving you hanging and says, I can't, I'm not going to do it? Yeah, pretty much. Why didn't you uh, change the plate when you were told to? Because the car has been parked, I haven't drove it. It's been parked in my driveway. So I don't drive it unless, like... So you know you got all the outstanding tickets 
Even if you're telling me the truth, so you drive the car, you drive it right in front of City Hall, which is heavily patrolled. Yeah. Right, and you get booted. Yeah. Now, the registered owner is Pablo Green. Mm -hmm. Does Pablo have a car? No, not at the moment. Mm. He doesn't. He doesn't drive a vehicle. No. He actually, he's with his girlfriend, so they like, she has the car registered so in her name. So you know he registers the car in her name. Yeah. He's got the scam going on. He registers cars in his sister's name, his girlfriend's name, right? Well, to begin with, it's going to cost you $100 to get the boot released. That's number one. Mm -hmm. but, but wherever you go, the car's going to get booted. Yeah, I'm just going to not have to, I'm going to have to figure something out. There's been no tickets since he made he gave that order. Mm -hmm. So his order was to leave the tickets open for the registered owner to come in. So I'm going to reinstate Judge McKinnon's order. Okay. But she still owes the 100 for this. Absolutely. Current order. Okay, Judge. I'll just I'll just explain it to Alyssa. I'm sure she's familiar with it. Okay, I made a notation. I'm reinstating the order of Judge McKinnon of January 10th. 2019. Okay. $100 boot fee. Thank you, Judge. Thank you. Good luck to you. All right. Mm. Come on. How cool is that? If you'd like to see more cases like this one, tune into Court in Providence every weekday. Excuse me? You didn't know Court in Providence is also a TV show. Oh, wow. Your life just got substantially better. To find out what channel we're on, go to courtinprovidence.com, click on your local listings, Scroll down till you find your hometown, then start doing your happy dance. That's it. Move it. Move it. Nice. All rise and hit subscribe so you don't miss the latest viral moments like this one. Share these videos and weigh in on the cases. You be the judge. Subscribe now.